Go to Singapore. <laughs> and welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to more F1 2021. And now today, it looks like we have to go to Melbourne Grand Prix circuit, the streets of Albert Park for the, uh, for the Australian Grand Prix. But remember, there is no 16 turns. But it's okay, it's still, but it still says 16 turns, but unfortunately... But once again, but I'm virtually forced, but I'm, once again, I'm really virtually the 16 turns. And now it's 14 turns. And we get to F1 2022. Welcome we to the Australian Grand Prix in Melbourne for what no doubt will be an intense day of racing. There's the city down in Melbourne. The Melbourne circuit is certainly one that needs to be taken seriously. Its combination of slippery surfaces and difficult corners make it a tricky track when it comes to overtakes. Three DRS seconds. find it hard to pass and will need to take full advantage of those DRS turns if they want to have any hope of breaking through. Oh, but remember, they got rid of that, so... And that other chicane also got rid of that and too. And as always, a man with plenty of racing experience joins me in the commentary box. Today it's Anthony Davidson. Tell me, Ant, you're no stranger to surviving the melee of turn one. So how do you keep out of trouble when there's so much going on around you? There are three main things to worry about there, Crofty. Positioning, awareness, and discipline. First, you have to put your car in a bit of space and make sure you have room to react to what the others are doing. Then you have to watch your mirrors and listen to the sounds around you to get a sense of where everyone is. And finally, just don't get too greedy. Just because a gap exists doesn't always mean you should go for it. Let's run you through the driver grid order for today's exciting race. Sergio Perez leads away from pole position. So your race starts on pole. Completes the front row. With Lewis Hamilton on the front row, which is me. Bottas, Followed by Foundry Bottas, Max Verstappen. Followed by Yuki Sonoda with Sebastian Vettel, with Pierre Gasly, Daniel Ricciardo, Lando Norris, Lando Norris, Carlos Sainz, Ross Stroll, Charles Leclerc, with Fernando Alonso, Esteban Ocon, with Mick Schumacher, Nicholas Latifi, with Nikita Mazepin, and Kim Raikkonen, with Antonio Giovanni, and George Russell back at the grid. It's time to head down to the track. Here we go. Reload our sap really quick because we're at we're in the streets. Melbourne Grand Prix Circus at the streets of Albert Park for the uh, for the Australian Grand Prix. It's the Australian Grand Prix. Here we go. Here come the lights. Four, five, red lights are on now. And we are underway at the uh, and Australian Grand Prix gets underway. Oh, we're gonna bank off early lap for Sap and Sam in front. Turn one, turn two, right there. So where I saw you right there, where it's, that's where Max was standing. I pull over and turn two. There we go, and then to the inside, Max was standing up into P3. Three they land when Lionel pull over. Oops, that was what a panda safe. Let me know you're okay. Oh, and there goes two wheels off. Are you okay, Lewis? Uh, yeah, I'm okay, let hands we get Okay, oh we got our first fire. One flashback. There is There is flashback potentially, so in the Grand Prix you've into turn six, are you? Here we come right there. The back of the left, I'll let the left, I'll let the left, I'll let the left, stay out in front, and also let Sergio Perez also stay out in front. Here comes for Sampen. By the way, there's no DRS until all lap three. I'm still into the DRS range, so the Sam are looking to the outside. Here we go in the 15. Turn 15 and it's turn 16. 
And now look into the inside of our team. He found three bonus. Wonder. Chris Perez, Francis, Black, the goal. Son and the pass. Valley Bell now brought into P2. Here we come on Sergio Perez. Black Perez, say ahead of us. Here we come for turn three. Into turn four. Into turn five. That's a victory. Into turn six. So we got Perez. Got some turn. And up into P1. Yes, great job. Great job. Excellent work. First place now, P1. Thanks, Jeff. Thanks, Jeff. And fastest in the second sector than anybody. But unfortunately, the, the outer things they got rid of it too, so. Good job, he was the fastest lap of the race so far. And a turn for now. Just amazing! Well done! And Mercedes have pulled off a great victory here today. And talk to me, what do you think it was that sealed the win for them? I'd say it was down once again to good, consistent driving. Nailing the corners, working to the track conditions and perfecting the team's strategies. They got all of these things right today and the results speak for themselves. And I can see the drivers starting to approach the podium for the victory celebrations. A real team victory today. Everybody played their part. Congratulations then to Mercedes, your race winners today. Now, let's discuss, Ants. Who would you say is a contender for driver of the day? It's got to be Lewis Hamilton. I mean, he pulled up some impressive feats out on the track today, even by his standards. Well, Ants, an end to another fantastic weekend of racing. Thanks to everyone who joined us, and we'll see you for the next one. I'm Lewis Hamilton getting the win with me. With four minutes and 21 seconds, taking the fast time for the race. 24 6 with Sergio Perez. Comes home in second place, and Max Verstappen will round up the podium. P2, P3 finish for Red Bull. Fred is in 4P1, P4 finish for him.
P's a Yuki, piece number 10, for P Gansley 6, P5, P6, for attack. So, Chevelle's 7 foot 4, time for World well, Champion, January Connor, he got his hometown at his hometown, back of Andrew Norris, 9th and Shaw Claire. Rounds up the top 10, as Carlos and Lab for P10 and P11, and Fist Fall for Ryan, with Lance, Joe Tuck, with Aspen Con, 13th for an announcer, Consent 14th for the Super Time World Champion, P13 and P14 for Aspen Con, TP. And with me, Shimmer comes in 16 for the 2020 Four Year Champion. Team Rocket is 17th, the key has been 19th. Tony Giovanni 19th, and George Russell comes home in 20th in last place. Now, the standings holding on the league with 531 point at lead over Sergio Perez. Very close, Razor Rose getting closer. And now, the constructor standings as Mercedes gets here on top 825 over Red Bull. I mean,